Well, have you ever been driving down the road and all of a sudden your rear view mirror falls right off? Well, I'm going to show you today how to put it back on. So the first thing you're going to want to do is get some blades and you're going to want to clean off the old glue from the windshield and then you're going to use some Windex and paper towel to make sure we got a nice clean surface and then pick this up at AutoZone. It is a Revere mirror replacement kit. So basically you're going to put the glue on the back of this, unscrew it from your mirror, glue this back to the windshield. You hold this to the windshield for at least a good um, minute and then wait about a half hour before you put the mirror back on and uh, take, a, take a piece of tape and go across here and tape this to the window. Okay, so now we got that nice and clear. Never mind those spots, that's on the outside, guys. It's not on the inside. Trust me, I scrubbed that to death. Those are all on the outside. So now we're gonna get ready to apply our glue and put our piece to the windshield. Okay, so now we done held that up there. I'm just gonna cut a piece of tape, put it up there so I know I don't come down, wait a half hour, let it solid and uh, dry all up and put the mirror back on. All right, so once it's been a half hour and that uh, dries up all the way, which I'm not gonna be able to show you in this video, I'm getting ready to take off. Um, so what you do with your mirror here, you will slide this. I'm trying to get a good camera angle here. You'll just slide it back down on there uh, on the plate and there's a screw there. You just tighten up the screw. Don't super tighten it, just snug it up to where the mirror isn't bouncing around and you'll have your mirror back up and rolling. Simple enough, guys. You can do it yourself. And then once you do take the tape off, let it sit there for a half hour and seal up. You can always take that same razor blade you use to clean the window, clean any excess glue off. I'm sure there's a little bit of glue running down from underneath, I'm sure. Um, you can just take a razor blade and clean that up so that way it's nice and neat for you. All right, guys, thanks for viewing. Until next time, have a good one.